Hey gang, let me straighten this up a little bit. Okay, this is a, this is a subject I talked about years ago. Although this subject was something different because I was talking about a particular football player named Colin Kaepernick, who decided that he was going to pull a nothing more than a media slash publicity stunt on taking a knee during the national anthem, in which. Everybody who found out later on, it was really just that. It was just a publicity stunt, media stunt, because he was going to be benched that year due to, I guess, nagging injuries or something like that. And and there was another report coming out saying that he didn't get to play on he didn't get to play the position he wanted to play on with the 49ers. Of course, that year was not the 49ers' best season. And so, in response to him taking a knee during the playing of the national anthem. Uh, people burned up 49ers merchandise and everything like that and got clearly upset. And as I said, I did a video on uh, on this whole thing a few years ago, which a lot of the comments on there were not very kind. I mean, some people actually called me a racist, and I went, how am I a racist? I said no racist terms. I said no racist words. I just called him an attention-craving celebrity like most celebrities are. The thing is, gang, when that whole thing was over, said, and done with, it, it would have seemed like that there was going to be no more people taking a knee during the national anthem, but it just kept going on and on and on. And not just at football events, but at pretty much any sporting event you could think of. And it didn't matter if it was if it a national, uh, national game, small town game, or something like that. People were, people were still taking a knee during the uh, national anthem. And apparently they're still doing it to this day. Isn't it about time this crap stops? I mean, you found out the truth as to why he did it. Why are you guys still doing this? Do you think he even really cares anymore? I mean, obviously he's moved on and he's probably still making his millions and millions of dollars from the NFL and merchandise and everything like that if they, if they haven't cut him off of that. I mean, why is it that people out there are such sheep? I mean, this whole thing really goes back to a few years ago when, when that Confederate flag uh, controversy was happening. When Walmart said, we're not going to have the Confederate flag in our stores anymore because what happened with that, with that idiot who went in and uh, shot up that church and everything like that. And it was like, and, you know, and Walmart said, we're not going to do the Confederate flag thing anymore. And some people protested by driving around Walmart for one weekend. Unfortunately, around here, it kept going for about an entire month. That's pretty much what it's all about. People just don't know when to stop. It's like, look, you made your impact. You did what you're supposed to do. There's no need to keep doing, keep this thing going for on and on and on and on and on. It's like, it's like, a, it's like a joke you've heard a thousand times. You basically just sit there and go, huh, it's not funny anymore. And this whole taking a knee thing, again, we all found out what it was really all about. It was just, he was mad. There was no taking a knee during the national anthem, although he, he, he more than likely said that that's what it was all about. But really, it was just, he was just upset. He was mad because he couldn't play. He didn't get the position he wanted on the team. So for those of you who want to keep doing this crap, keep being a sheep. And those of us who are individuals keep walking the earth and just stop following other people. Because you know something? There are such things as, you know, you just take something that goes on for far too long, keeps on going and going, 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 until eventually the impact is, is done and it means nothing. So you morons that want to keep taking a knee, it means nothing. You're just doing it for media attention. You're just doing it because you want to get on the local news. You want to get on some sort of uh, some sort of news website and things like that. You're just doing it for the attention because you just want to sit back, clap your little hands like a seal, and go, "Ooh, we're on the news! We're on the news! We're on the news!" And this whole thing about about you know people are going to take a knee during the Olympics and throw up some kind of a hand signal. You know what? As far as the Olympics go, I never really watched it, but if you're really going to do this, that really proves. You guys are sheep. So the sheeple out there, just stop and get the flock out of here. Thanks for watching, everybody. God bless you all. Hope you're having an awesome day. 
I uh, hope you enjoyed the video, and if you like my videos, please feel free to subscribe, and please, please leave your comments down below about what you think about, you know, this whole knee-taking thing going on for far too long, because honestly, like I said, it's, 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 it's like a running joke, it's not funny anymore. So take care of yourselves, try to be good, try to be good to yourself, try to be good to others. Let's keep praying this virus nightmare is going to end very, very soon. Let's, um, let's help others who really, really need it right now. And uh, let's stop trying to destroy the world. It's in bad enough shape as it is. Take care of yourselves. And uh, whether or not you believe in God, he believes in you. Till we do this again, as always, stay strong and rock on.